Hey guys, it's Phil, and as you can see, I've got a bunch of boxes here that were sent to me. These are all for the Einscan 3D Pro Scanning Equipment. Uh, I've got three huge boxes here. Let's open them up and see what's inside. Okay, let's start off with the small little box here. This is actually the color pack that will attach to the scanner and allow it to handle uh, all of the color information as well as the model. Take a look in you. Actually already got you tape open. Package comes from China, so there's Chinese instructions, but we also have English. Alright, you are really tightly packed in there. There we go. Next to two aside. So I'm gonna try to open this little bit neatly because I do have to send these back there not for me to keep. Okay. Lots of plastic. Oh. Got an Allen wrench. And inside we have the actual device here. Looks like it has a little camera inside along with some LED lights. I think that's how it works. <laughs> And this is the cord that attaches to the back of the device itself. And then we have a little mounting screw to attach it. Okay, let's see what we got in the next box. Right here now we have the next largest size box up. I'm not sure if I actually even need a knife for this one. Let's see. No. Okay, I'm not sure how I'm going to show this, but there's inside the box. Okay, so we have a bunch of stickers, a whole pile of stickers. These are little tracking stickers you can put on whatever you're scanning if you need a little extra help. Okay, we have a big felt package. And I believe this is this is a plate that you use for calibrating the device. And we have a white side for calibrating the color balance, and then the dots for calibrating the sensor itself. That's in a nice cloth felt bag so it doesn't get messed up. See what else we have in here? This is a uh, little plate that you use to set up the... It's like a little stand for the plate that I just showed you. You sit it up on there so that the scanner can look at it. There's a keychain. Uh, oh, it is a USB thumb drive. It must have software on it. That's pretty neat. Let's see, we have some cables. We have a power brick. I don't know what this is. It says Lucky Look. Package is kind of coming apart. Don't know. It looks like it somehow mounts your phone to poles and stuff. I don't know what that has to do with the product, but I guess we'll figure it out. And finally, there it is. This is the actual scanner itself, the handheld unit. You can see we have two cameras on either side with a projector in the middle, which projects a pattern or various patterns of lines on your model. We have two buttons, plus and minus. Uh, we have a play button, which is I guess what starts the scan. 
And then we have connections for your uh, PC and for the color kit that I just showed you. Okay, so that's, that's not too heavy. I could easily hold this out in my arm uh, for a long period of time, no trouble. But it does feel sturdy, uh, like it's made of good quality plastic, it's not cheap at all. So I'm going to be interested to check this out and see how well this works. Okay, let's move on to the next box. Okay, this is the largest box of the three I got. It's pretty big. I believe this is the turntable kit. Okay, open. This is very big. That is one massive bag. It's a Ziploc bag. Keep your equipment fresh. Okay, with some effort, that is out of the bag. Let's see what else we have here. Ah, we have a product list in Chinese and in English. Uh, it says it includes the turntable, USB cable, power cable, power adapter, desktop tripod, and cradle switch stand. See what all this is. Okay, here we have a USB cable. Put that down. Okay. More bags. This is the actual turntable kit. This is the nicer version. I believe there's a cheaper version that does not have these tracking spots on it. These, I, as I understand, they're not necessary, but if you need a little extra support, you're having trouble scanning certain areas, you can have it track these as well. And this is motorized, and it connects to your computer, so uh, it will just automatically turn around, and the scanning will be you know, happening as it turns. So, see in the back here, we have simply power plug and USB. And... That's about it. It's a pretty simple device. And we have a tripod. It's a pretty nice, sturdy tripod, too. This is, uh, this is so you can mount the scanner on here and have it aim down at the turntable or any other thing you might choose and yeah and so that'll keep it nice and stable so you won't have any shaking going on over here with your hands uh, so that will be useful and here we have another bracket i believe this would be for attaching the scanner to the tripod because the scanner itself does not have any kind of mounting screws. Looks like all we have left is the power brick. And that's it. So that's it. I'm really excited to get started checking this stuff out. Um, I'm gonna really put it through its paces and try to do a whole lot of different scans in the couple of weeks that I have this equipment. So keep an eye out for those videos. Comment below and let me know what you would scan if you had access to really high-end equipment like this. If you want to check out this equipment yourself, there are Amazon affiliate links below. Also, I'm on Patreon. If you want to help support more videos like this one, you can find a link to help out in the description below. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. It's like a little stand for the bracket that I... So keep an eye out for those videos. Uh, 